One important concept uh, when we create uh, long integers is the use of literal uh, suffix. For example, if I want to create um, a floating point number, let's call it my new float, I can say or I can provide it with a value and assign it to this variable. But I can also uh, give it a literal value f to say that this is either f or caps lock f suffix to say this is a floating point number. And I can also create a, a double, say a long double. And my new long double and can provide it with the number 123.3 and the literal literal suffix of L. So the use of a literal suffix is to um, implicitly convert data types without losing uh, their precision value. So for example, if I go from um, a double to a floating point a number, and if I have this literal suffix on my value, it will tell me that I'm going to lose precision. That means, let me say I create float value, my float, my next float, and assign it my new double. This will trigger a compiler warning saying that you're going to lose precision. On the other hand, if I don't specify this literal suffix and try to um, assign a value to um, a new float variable from a long double, that warning might not be triggered. So that's one of the benefits of using literal suffix when we use um, long data type and floating point numbers.